How's it going everybody? It's your boy homie G and I'm back chilling here at the park with my kids. I'm in the car. It's kind of cold. I can see them. Don't worry. They're right in front of me. I can see them. Anyways, this video is by request and it's a tough topic. So I'm going to try to do my best to address it the way I can. Um, so here it is. And it's how do you come out to your parents? How do you tell them that you're gay, lesbian, or even transgender? It's not an easy thing to do. Obviously, if it was easy, there wouldn't need to be people asking for videos, right? Or Googling how to do it. Um, so this has plagued many people um, for a long time, since hundreds of years. How do you do this, you know, the right way? And my little homies have some bad news. There really isn't a right way to do this, okay? Anyone who tells you that this is the way to do it is lying to you. Because all parents are different, all situations, circumstances, environments are different and so you have to account for all of these different variables um, and one way of doing it is not going to handle all those variables for example your parents might be very open-minded your parents may be okay with just about everything um, or your parents may be very religious very rigid very strict you know and they may see this as sinful um, so you know where you are in that scenario it'll be different too so um, bottom line there's not a single right way to do it I will give you some suggestions my little homies S ask for your parents time sit them down no siblings just you and them uh, tell them you have something deeply important to tell them about you uh, that you've been wanting to get off your chest for a very long time that it's been bothering you um, for a very long time because you feel you haven't been able to be honest with them and also because you haven't been able to live a sincere and genuine life true to yourself because of it and once you kind of build that background then just they're gonna be like what is it what is it what is it don't keep them you know uh, guessing about it any longer just break it to them let them know hey mom dad I'm gay I'm lesbian I'm transgender um, and see what happens now second up are the reactions right how are they going to react well some parents are going to be like son daughter that took a lot of courage to do that uh thank you for letting us know you know we're going to love you no matter what you're our son you're our daughter we love you that's you know applause uh, great reaction not hurtful to you you know the best case scenario but there might be other types of reactions from your parents they might be indifferent about it meaning they kind of like might put their head down may even get up and walk away or even you know further down the harsh line there they might uh they may uh want to like rebuke you say you know what that's wrong that's not how god intended us to be are you sure questioning you um are you are you you know certain of it how do you know and and that could be other types of reactions that might be hurtful to you um you know even worse they could say get out you know or you're no longer our son we disown you or you're no longer our daughter um you just broke our hearts you know overreaction uh you know adults will react in many many different ways because they have a certain programming in their mind about how things should be and kind of when you when you take that little dream of theirs away um, you know all hell breaks loose in their mind okay and they just feel like they've been harmed and wronged and um, but you know here's the thing my little homies you cannot expect to control the reaction you are gonna be in your mind coming up with a million different scenarios of how they can react but stop doing that because ultimately you can't you can't control how they react and uh, pretending that you uh, if you do this, this is going to happen, or if you do the A, then B will happen. It's foolish, okay? You just got to do it. You just got to buckle down and do it because enough of you living with this inner secret that's been plaguing you, that's been eating at you, that's been a burden on you, that it feels like 300 pounds on your back, you just got to straight up do it. And whatever the outcome is, this is the last thing I got to tell you. Live your life. Be happy that you did that. No matter the outcome, be, ha be happy that you got it out of, off your chest, that now you can live your life the way, who, the way you are, who you are. And, um, and I understand that there's going to be a lot of fallout from this, 
but maybe in the future your parents and you will reconcile and they'll learn to accept you for who you are that's been known to happen in many families maybe they'll just not uh, you know and but what are you gonna do you can't be depressed about it for the rest of your life you can't live a sad life yeah it's hurtful and you know but ultimately it's your life and your parents that's their life you know they can't um, control their emotions about this and come to come to terms with it that's that's something you can't control and unfortunately uh, you may never be able to uh, control so um, you just got to push on move your move li move life forward um, live your life and be true to yourself because that's that's the one thing you must do in life and that is be sincere okay if you're not sincere you're a fake and no one wants to live a fake life so my little homies as hurtful as your parents reactions can be um, you have to do what you have to do and you have to live your life and you know what there's gonna be other people there to support you you're not alone there's a lot of people there to support you there's teachers even other family members I have two family members that I know of that for sure you know uh, are not heterosexual but we love them we everybody loves our uh, we love ourselves and then our family right um, that's my family though you know your family may be different but main point is you're not alone and uh, everyone here uh, on this planet uh, um, you know is here to support you and you know ultimately bottom line is be true to yourself my little homies that's all I can say and good luck all right my little homies Keep the questions coming. I appreciate them. I appreciate your courage. Taking the time to write me questions uh, below these videos is great. All right, my little homies, I'm out.